What's up? It's your girl Reese and welcome back to my space. If you're new here, welcome. We talk everything work style, fashion, and beauty here on this channel. And if you're old, thank you for rocking with me for another week. Today we are getting into winter wear. And last year I said that I was going to try to make an effort to dress better in the winter and not be such a front bucket. And I think I've been doing a pretty good job of it. So I wanted to give you guys a little bit of winter inspo to continue on what I did last year, and this is the video from last year. I loved it. Um, but yeah, so this year we'll get into a little more chattier video, but some inspo for you guys as well. So for my first outfit, I am wearing my good old trusty thigh-high Chloe boots that I bought last year on sale. Honestly, top favorite purchases ever. I get so much use out of these boots. I wear them in almost all seasons, like springtime sometimes, fall definitely, winter, uh-huh. Uh, I wear them with pants, I wear them with dresses, I actually wear dresses more because I own them. They are amazing and honestly a pants replacement because they go halfway up my thigh. It is incredible. And they have a small heel so it's pretty comfortable. I can I can walk in them all, all day. Love them, love them, love them. So here I paired them with this ASOS Utility dress. It's super boxy. I love it. The color is beige. My beige life. It's me. Um, yeah, this is just cute winter fit. You can wear layers underneath of it because it's boxy so it gives you room for that to, to get, get warmer. Throw whatever kind of coat you want on top. It's cute. Cash and cute. And for my next look, sad day. This is actually a dupe of a plaid coat that I really, 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 really loved by, by uh, Isabel Morant. But I missed it when sale season came by. I had it in my, my wish list and when it hit sale, it sold out so fast. So yeah, we were all done to look. It is a plaid longer coat past your knees, but I found a dupe that is shorter. Uh, so I, I had to have it, you know, I had to have it to make up for it and I, and I really like it. And plaid is super casual, um, but here I wore it with an all black outfit and threw on some beige uh, boots with a little bit of a heel because there's beige running through my plaid and threw on the plaid coat. And I actually bought this in a large to fit oversized. And yeah, I like it. It's super warm too. The material is really warm. Uh, depending on what I wear underneath of it, I could wear this by itself, but also you could throw a coat on top of it to stay warmer. But yeah, I thought this was cute. Mm, and this is this is what I have instead of the Isabel Moret. Sad, sad day. Okay, for my next look, this is one of my favorites. I haven't worn this yet, um, but I wore something very similar in the fall. I love the leather look. Uh, leather goes with everything. Leather is for all seasons and all occasions. Can't get enough. So I got these really cute leather joggers and I've been trying to find every excuse in the world to wear them and I've worn them with everything. So I found this stunning leather top that's actually so thick. Or, this is all full leather, by the way. Um, that's super thick. So I paired the top with the bottom and then with some leather uh, boots with the heel on them and I think this is just the ultimate casual look. It would look great with a fun pair of sunnies and like a crossbody designer bag like the small ones that everybody has but you know I don't do small bags so I, I didn't have a small bag to throw on top of this so this is the look. We love it. We're gonna wear this so so much. Okay on to my coat looks now. For my first one I got this amazing Bane, you know, if you watch Batman, the one with Bane in it, I love his coat. Everybody loves his coat. That's an incredible coat. And honestly, this gives me Bane vibes. So, had to have it. It's from Oak and Fort. So, I've been wearing this with friggin' everything. But here, I paired it with a bodysuit, long sleeve bodysuit, a pair of jeans, and I threw on my slouchy snake print boots um, for different textures. You know, lots of different colors, all in the neutral family, but still different textures. Love it, great look, I am, I am Bane. Yes. And for my last look, it is my casual look, but still not like from, I think. I mean, I do look like a big marshmallow, but I write it. So I bought this puffer because I haven't bought a puffer in years. Um, I was wearing my puffer from high school maybe? Maybe my first year of university from Roots that lasted forever. You have to get puffers that last forever, especially if you live in Canada, it's freezing. Um, so 
I got that pepper in a size extra small and I thought it was time to upgrade me. That was gray and kind of frumps. Um, so I decided this year that I would get a black one because black goes with everything. Uh, and this black uh, puffer doesn't have any logos and I like that. So I was torn between this one and the Aritzia one, but I tried this one and I liked it better. I was influenced by uh, this photo of Rosie Huntington. She is just like a style queen. She wore her puffer and I'm sure it's like a Rick Owens puffer, which is really what I wanted, but I could not, could absolutely not justify buying a $5,000 puffer. So I went with this Lululemon one, which is like four or $500. Um, but I was inspired by this photo of her where she's wearing a puffer and she has like a sleek bun and she's wearing some pumps and she looks just fabulous in a damn puffer and was like, hun, we need that to happen. So I thought this puffer gave me the Rick Owens vibe without the Rick Owens price tag. But here I wore it super cash. I wore it all black. You don't even see what I'm wearing underneath it, but I'm wearing all black. Black pants, black Uggs, my black puffer, and don't come for my Uggs. I love Uggs. I've been wearing Uggs since high school and I'm going to wear them forever. We don't care. These are pretty old actually. You can tell they're just like, they're not all black anymore. They look, they've, been, they've been through a lot. So that's it for me. I hope you guys got some winter inspo. Uh, if you have any suggestions for outfits, please leave them below. I'm always trying to look nice in this hideous weather. I need all the inspo I can get. And if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe and I will see you guys next time. Bye!